Hey guys, saw a lot of people talking about using stops in the after hours and pre market, so I'll just do a quick video. So let's say I'm just going to buy just 10 shares of top. Okay, so what you want to do, the way it works, is you have to set up a trigger order. So say I want my stop to be 530, I'll just do a one share order, right, because that's the smallest amount you can do at 530. Now, when this activates, i.e., when I buy this one share at 530, I want to set up a trigger order like this that I then do, uh, I then change my share count to position and I have my limit as whatever I want. So, you know, I like to do, let's say I'll do like 520 just in case it slips 10 cents, right? So when this one share order activates, it's gonna sell the uh, the position up to a price of 520. Obviously if it was at 510, it, you know, I, would, I might not get filled if it slipped that much, but you know, you just do your offset, whatever you think is like worst case, I would say. And then you just click send new order. So I'll just bring this up, just so you see. When this fills, there you go, my position went to zero. So it bought that one share, but my share's to 11, and then sold the whole position. And that's it for this, for if you're short, it's opposite. You know, don't blame me as well if this doesn't work for you. Thanks.